This is day 16 of making a game in 75 days. I spent most of today working on getting road spline generation to be more natural. To do this, I figured the best approach would be to take the splines point and then find what height the mesh would form in the same X and Z position, and then compare that to the same for the next point. From that, we can calculate the slope. This gives us the ability to tell the spline to regenerate differently if the slope from one point to another is too great. It's important to set a limit though, so it will eventually stick with the new segment if it takes too many generations. I did this by upping the slope tolerance every time a segment had to regenerate. Without this, there's a chance a successful segment isn't possible because all generations won't meet the slope requirement. Putting this into practice will give us roads that follow the slope of the terrain. There is still some work to do with it though. While working on it, I ran into some pretty strange generations after I messed up my density combiner. Honestly, one of the coolest things I've ever accidentally made. Other than that, I'll see you all on day 17.